all of Tawheed is encompassed in Surah Al-Ikhlas. That's why it's such an important Surah. And I'll give you one example. I've told this story before, but it's a very interesting story that happened to me. I was in the Emirates. I was probably maybe 21. And I was with some Bedouins. And, uh, you know, they, in the Emirates they carry, uh, they have these sticks they carry for the camels. And uh, it was in Al Ain, the city of Al Ain. And I was with these Bedouin, and, and one of them asked me, like, what I was before I was Muslim. I told him I was Christian, and he asked me what Christians believe. And I said, well, they believe, for instance, Jesus is Son of God. And then, and then this Bedouin, he was pretty, he was, if I remember correctly, he was, you know, he was a younger man. And, and there were some older men in, in the thing. And he said, uh, he said, Hal you know, ma'gul. Like that, that makes sense because he, he didn't have a father. Like he said, you know, Mary was his mother, but he didn't have a father. So that makes sense why they would say he was, Allah was his father. That's what he said. The, the man next to him, the older man, he took his stick and hit him. And he said, Lem yulid wa lam yulad. You know, and I, and I realized from that story what an amazing uh, chap, the surah of ikhlas that, that takes very simple people and really makes them theologians. You know, because that really was what, what he understood it. Lam yulid wa lam yulad. Right? He, he, did, he, did, he wasn't a walid and he wasn't a mawlud. He didn't give birth and to anything. And he nothing came out of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in that way. He's not... Alhamdulillah.